Commercial businessman Jacob Juma was shot dead by gunmen while driving to his car in home in Nairobi last night. Police say he was blocked and shot several times, but nothing was stolen from him, according to a report filed in the occurrence book at the Karen police station. Juma was known for courting controversy on various issues on his Twitter handle when commenting on topical issues of the day. He was the director and the proprietor of Cortec Mining Kenya Limited, and in what appears to have been a premonition on his death, Juma tweeted on March the 25th that, uh, and I quote, freedom is expensive, death is a must for everybody. I will not fear death and stay in comfort zone as majority of Kenyans suffer anymore. End of quote. Juma's killing was among trending topics on Twitter this morning with Kenyans urging authorities to thoroughly investigate and prosecute those responsible. Now, also joining those who condemn the killing is a court leader, Raila Odinga, who visited the Lee Funeral Home, where the body of Jacob Juma was taken from the city mortuary. Raila was accompanied by Juma's widow and other opposition leaders. We cannot have a situation where security agencies which are hired to protect people, the ones who shoot people with impunity, you will know that nothing will happen. So this is a challenge to the, those who are running this country. Tell them that uh, you can kill as many as you like, but ultimately the people will resist. So I urge the president to go out of his way and do what he was mandated to do and he took an oath of what he to do, protect the constitution, defend and protect the constitution, which protects the lives of each and every king.